in Tech Time with me, Andrew Humphrey, the billionaire space race is back on. But this mission is for a very good cause, as one private uh, astronaut promises to take his crew closer to the moon than anyone has since the last Apollo mission 50 years ago. Just five months after becoming the first all civilian commercial astronauts on a multi day orbit around Earth. Welcome, everybody, to Crew Dragon Resilience. Billionaire Jared Isaacman is heading back up and is looking to break records. We're going to go farther into space than, than humans have gone since we've last walked on the moon. Isaacman is leading a new SpaceX mission program called Polaris. Last year, he commanded the Inspiration 4 mission which was a fundraiser for St. Jude Children's Hospital, raising a staggering $240 million. Now, Isaacman is taking that fundraiser global and paying for three more trips to space. He's planning to use SpaceX's new Starlink satellite network to connect people anywhere in the world with St. Jude. So maybe the families that are out there that don't even realize they need the help of a St. Jude can, can get the benefit of, of their research and science. Joining Isaacman on Polaris Dawn later in 2022 is veteran Air Force fighter pilot Scott Poteet, SpaceX operations engineer Sarah Gillis, and engineer Anna Menon, serving as the onboard medical officer. Two of them will even perform the first ever commercial astronaut spacewalk. You know, I think it's natural to have some butterflies, but I, I deeply have faith in the SpaceX team. You know, we're going to be prepared. We're going to start training here pretty soon. Um, there's inherent risk in anything we do. I'm so excited to just see what it's like, see what the environment is like. This mission is all taking place on Elon Musk's Starship rocket, which has been built to one day fly to the moon and eventually to Mars but critics continue to question the financial aspect of spending so much money on private space trips. It comes right back to the theme of we can make progress for tomorrow um, without ignoring some of the hardships of today. A pledge to expand both commercial space exploration and St. Jude's life-saving mission here on Earth. And the hopes and likelihood of adding to that quarter billion dollars for St. Jude's Hospital is certainly riding high. Starship's first unmanned test flight will take place in months.